Marsha Clark served as the lead prosecutor during O.J. Simpson's trial for the murders of Nicole Brown Simpson and Ron Goldman. Marsha Clark, the former lead prosecutor on the highly publicized O.J. Simpson murder trail, is speaking out after his death. I send my condolences to Mr. Simpson's family, Clark said in a statement to E.T. Simpson's children revealed that the former NFL pro died on Wednesday at the age of 76 following a battle with cancer. On April 10th, our father Orenthal James Simpson succumbed to his battle with cancer, read the statement shared on X, formerly Twitter. He was surrounded by his children and grandchildren. During this time of transition, his family asks that you please respect their wishes for privacy and grace. Simpson's murder trial took place from Sep 26, 1994 to Oct 3, 1995. The NFL pro was accused of murdering his then ex-wife, Nicole Brown Simpson, and her friend, Ron Goldman, inside her home in Brentwood, California. During the trial, Simpson was represented by the Dream Team, which consisted of lawyers Johnny Cochran, Robert Kardashian, F. Lee Bailey, and Robert Shapiro. After a nine-month trial that captivated the nation, Simpson was found not guilty of both murders on Octed 3, 1995. Clark took a leave of absence after the trial before returning to a career in law. In 1997, Simpson was unanimously found liable for the wrongful death of and battery against Goldman and battery against Brown. In 2016, Clark was portrayed by Sarah Paulson in the Ryan Murphy's FX series, American Crime Story, The People Ver O.J. Simpson. That year, Clark spoke with E.T. about the series, sharing that it was phenomenal, but that watching the events of the case unfold was like reliving a nightmare. Watching it happen again on television was enormously painful, Clark told E.T. It's killing me all over again. In addition to Clark, Fred Goldman, the father of Ron Goldman, reacted to the news of Simpson's death in a statement to E.T. This is a reminder of how long Ron and Nicole have been gone and missed, he said in a statement on behalf of him and his wife, Patty Goldman. It's not about the killer, it's about the victim. 